our Father, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you for the day. We thank you for your word. Thank you for your spirit. You said at the end time you are going to pour out your spirit on all flesh and you are going to raise men. And uh, most especially, you are raising me to the music industry so that I will tell the truth and the truth will set the people free in Jesus' mighty name. We pray. Father, as I speak the truth, let the truth uh, go forth and heal, of course, deliver a lot of people from the, the danger of Satan in Jesus' mighty name. We pray. Amen. Uh, I greet everyone of us, and of course, uh, this is Voice of Nigerians Worldwide, and this is where I, of course, speak to the entire world, and that's why you're seeing the map wall here. And uh, today, I'm going to make a presentation of, of uh, what is going on in the music industry. I'll talk about Kanye West and uh, what the kind of life is living now. Talk about Terry G, uh, love is, uh, is truth about the music industry, who you sing for. Also, I'll talk about Zazu. I'll talk about uh, uh, Bob Whiskey, uh, the controversy. Also, um, so many more. So uh, please, uh, I'd like us to go straight to uh, Kanye West. And uh, Kanye West, uh, I don't know, you came out sometime to tell the whole world that you want to work for God, we should show love, we should love one another, and we should work for Christ. But what is going on now? You parade with your new uh, wife, and you almost go naked. Go naked, you dress. You are introducing fashion that people should follow, because you are a role model, and people are following what you are doing. And you are introducing fashion to, to pollute everywhere. Is that how to work for God? The Bible said, old things must pass away, but new things must be gone in your life. There's no new thing there. Let me just show you some of the clip, and you know, he even came out saying he has his own life to live. Life that you're going to die, and nobody, uh, you face judgment after death, judgment. Let me just show you some clip, and I'm going to be back. This is Voice of Nigerians Worldwide. Yo, I just want to tell everybody I posted my wife three times on purpose. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> no. So what I'm saying is I delivered the album. Then people still in my comments talking about why are you posting your wife? Because she make me happy. That's why y'all happy with the music because I'm happy. You understand? So don't ever say nothing negative. If you don't like my page and don't like what I'm posting, go fuck yourself. Seriously, leave me, leave the king the fuck alone. I don't care, bro. I'm going to post my wife as much as I want. Go post your wife on your fucking Instagram. Okay, uh, you're welcome back. That is it. Uh, I do pray. I love him so very much. That he repents from his sin and, of course, do the right thing. Now, let me move to Terry G. I love that. Uh, Terry G and he was saying about the music industry. This is voice of Nigerians worldwide. I'm a secular musician. I sing for the devil. We sing for the devil. We praise the devil. We don't glorify God. You understand? Shall we just say all this one who they do so now God will get it from yourself? The Bible said in the book of Amos, chapter uh, 5, verse 23, it said, God said, Take that music out of the way. The music that glorifies, making noise to my ear. Not every music you sing that glorify God. You understand and uh what is going on now you know you see the uh, movement of the antichrist you see a lot of tattooing a lot of things and you say you are singing for god <laughs> that's the truth set you free now straight i'm going to move to uh the next presentation which is the uh what is going on the controversy between uh, zazu and of course uh bobby whiskey and you know before i start let me just talk to many millions of Nigerians and uh, people, creators, content creators, you know, sometimes you grab some things, you uh, send it on air. Please, even you yourself, let's start from every one of us. Are you are you already born again? Are you have you given your life to Christ? You know, we can come, we can judge, we can talk, we can do. Have, have you given your life to Christ? Anyway, um, I would say judge not, uh, but by their fruit we shall know them. Now, what where I'm going now is uh let me start with uh bobby whiskey uh please how can you transform yourself from uh man to woman in all in the name of fashion in the name of making it world worldwide having more famous and your soul is perishing 
because knowing not that no unclean things will enter and the bible says in the book of leviticus uh, 19 and other verse from 18 it was talking about immorality and lesbianism and sexualism and bible stated it there so i don't know <laughs> you can hear him let me play some clips and i'm gonna be back i fucking have a pussy how do you expect someone sexy like this oh yeah so this this was how this was how i went out today oh look, these people eh, now now they ask me stupid questions now they try you now they try you now they ask me useless question it's like a dagger question you look me fish like this as a friend like this. I'm gonna carry pretty come on. It's half now. Now to so I carry you. Happy love for brotherhood. If it comes to my hood, if it comes to the hood, you go so I would look up back, look up back. You are my brotherhood. Brother, brother. Uh, you're welcome back. This is Voice of Nigerians Worldwide, and I'm going to go straight to Zazu. I love the fact that you you are somebody who loves God, but be careful. <laughs> Satan is all over. You know, you come out, you, you entertain people, which I know is secular entertainment. You know, you entertain the world. But what, uh, what about the tattooing everywhere? The Bible says said in the book of uh, Leviticus uh, 19.28 was talking about that shall not cut their body or pierce their body or you know tattooing. The Bible speaks the tattooing. And you're, and you're coming to condemn somebody or you're coming to correct somebody. You also have to correct yourself. Let us all correct ourselves. And you see a lot of celebrity today. Tiwa Savage, you see tattooing. Oh, dress almost half naked. You, you, you almost you see a lot of women the draft africa these days you see a lot of things happening and of course this is the industry we are talking about whiskey the widow everybody tattooing here and there all this thing will not inherit the kingdom of god that's just the gospel truth it's suffered violent and only the value take it by force now uh please by the grace of god uh let me just of course play you the uh uh, beef song and you see how there are a lot of people just, uh, are celebrating on it we are supposed to be crying crying now see these people are going to hell because we no matter what we talk people say we judge i would say judge yourself that you you know where you are going all this thing cannot inherit the kingdom of god so i urge you and let's celebrate god let us all give our life to christ and celebrate God and accept Jesus as our personal Lord and Savior. Old things shall pass away, new things shall become. The Bible said, don't be conformed with the things of the world, but be it transformed with the renewal of your mind and your spirit. And nothing much. This is Voice of Nigerians worldwide. And I remain your host, your most uh, Felix Edeo. And of course, FFD Hip Hop Man of God. I'll keep on loving God. That's why I released a song called. Uh, we do for Jesus and keep on spreading the word of God through music and uh, at the same doctor. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. I'm going to be back with my next presentation. God bless you. Give your love to Christ. Jesus Christ is Lord. God bless you. This is Voice of Nigerians Worldwide.